Hey, what's up? This is Justin with wingsound.com. Let's say you got a bunch of samples that you want to change the pitch, but not alter the tempo. I'm going to show you how to do this with Elastic Properties in Pro Tools 8. So what you want to do first is go on your track and enable Elastic Audio and choose Polyphonic. Then you want to go to your Regions menu and choose Elastic Properties. So once Elastic Properties opens, you need to highlight the region that you're going to work with in order to use them. So as you can see, now it opened up. So all you really have to do here is just pitch shift. So I'm going to pitch, the, pitch shift this up plus 15 semitones. So now let's listen to it. So there you go. There's the chipmunk effect. Now it sounds a little weird. There's some like artifacts and weird stuff before and after each vocal part. So to kind of smooth it out a little bit, take the event sensitivity and bring it down to zero so it's not going to be as sensitive obviously and it's going to smooth it out slightly so in order to clean it up you know you might want to chop up each part and do little fade in and fade outs on it you know to get it a lot smoother now the reason why i use the elastic properties is because you can pitch shift without changing the tempo so once you align your vocal you know you want it to stay in tempo with your beat so use the elastic properties because it won't change the tempo of the vocal when you change the pitch you can always get in touch with justin at wingsound.com and check out more of justin's videos including these titles featuring the new pro tools 8 now available on demand at wingsound.com